Hey YouTube, it's me, it's your iPhone Captain, and today I'm going to show you some of the best tweaks you need to get for your iPad or iPhone that's come out just since 2012 began. And I'm going to have a couple different videos, so if you don't see one of your favorite tweaks in this video, chances are it'll be in the next one because I'm not going to be able to get all this on one video. I don't want to create a 30 minute video. But anyway, first up, I'm going to start you off with IntelliScreen X. Everybody knows what IntelliScreen X is. And this is what it looks like on the iPad 3 whenever you have Mountain Center installed. Okay, Mountain Center is what's allowing me to move my IntelliScreen X over here. And if I'm not mistaken, Mountain Center is $199. Uh, it may be $299. And IntelliScreen X is $999. I know for sure that it's $999. But, uh, I can't, no, Mountain Center is $2.99. I had it in my notes right here. All right, another awesome tweak that just came out is called Spero, S-P-E-E-R-O. And this is a multitask tweak that allows you to put whatever you want in the top row up here. You can select up to 20 different actions, they call them, and it's just putting whatever app you want in there. The second row is you like your toggles for Wi-Fi, volume, orientation, 3G, reboot, all that stuff. And this row here just tells some information about your, your device. And the bottom row is where the, tw the items that you have run in the background, applications that you have previously opened since you rebooted your device, is what will be open down here. And you can kill all those with one tap of the screen right here on that kill all apps right there. If I were to tap that, it would kill everything running in the background. All right, to, to dismiss this tweak, I just double tap the screen and it goes white. That's called Spiro. Another tweak that's just come out is called Chrome Customization. And this, probably, I should have showed this on the iPhone. It's easier to see. But what it does is it allows you to do some of the same gestures as you do in like Swipe Safari. And if you know who Ryan Petrich is, he is the developer of this tweak. This is a free tweak, by the way. It shouldn't even be in this video, but I just thought I'd throw it in. Another awesome tweak that just came out last few days is called Fold Music. And what Fold Music does is it puts your favorite artist on your springboard. And if you see, can see right here, um, let me turn my brightness down on my phone a little bit. I forget that every time. All right. You can see over here I've added an album of Bon Jovi right here. All I gotta do is tap that, and if I had a, more songs than that in there, it would be. Um, I thought I had another album on there, but I must not have. Anyway, to put another album on there, all I gotta do is go into settings, go to full music. It's a dollar fifty too, and right here I just tap add, and it opens up all of the content on my device okay let's let's say we won't put nickelback on there um, let's just do creed since it's here handy all right then i go back out and i should have a creed folder here with all of their songs in it right there it is and you see now i can get to the creed greatest hits just by simply tapping from my springboard. I don't have to go into iTunes and all that stuff. All right, that's a dollar fifty. Another awesome tweak. I was trying to do what was on the uh, iPad first is Deck, and Deck is another multitask, and I've got it set to open when I double tap the home button just for showing you on this video. But here's your toggles like Wi-Fi, volume, Bluetooth, all that. And you can change your custom or your tweak, your tweaks or 
applications that you see displayed here by just going into settings deck you can select whatever kind of activation you want you don't have to have double tap the home button you can select whatever you want here you set your default actions and here you've got seven custom actions and seven preset applications that I was showing you that you could see it and right here they are here's your seven toggles here's your seven right here here's your seven toggles here's your seven custom applications alright and deck HD that's what you're looking at here on the iPad I'm pretty sure it's a dollar ninety nine. Okay. Another awesome tweak that you need to check out. Looks like the rest of them are going to be on the iPhone. So let's go ahead and let me move the camera just a minute. So hold your, hold your eyeball still. I'm going to try to crank it down as gentle as I can without causing too much commotion. Sorry about that bump. All right, let's go to settings. One of my favorite apps on here is called Speak Events. And what it does is when like, it, it reads your emails and stuff to you, if you get a text message or something like that, it'll read them to you. You can set it to just read the subject line or you can set it to read the the whole body or both it's up to you but if I get a message and you see what I, I should right here it should read you heard it you heard it say a new message from Mitch Stevens okay I've got it set to just tell me who it's from I don't have it set to read the body or anything like that due to privacy I would it want it reading my emails and me up in the middle of Walmart or somewhere like that that's speak events and if I ain't mistaken it's a dollar ninety nine also um, it's an awesome tweet guys there's another one out there something like it called allowed a l o u d it does pretty much the same thing it just don't have as many options if you want to check it out you can check it out too Clockify just came out not too long ago. It puts a live clock on your screen. You see right here in iOS 5, it took a while for us to get that. So we finally got the clock and hits a dollar. And you can go in here and you can set it to display night and day differences. You can set 24 hour format. You can set your uh, display style, uh, default, no date, minimalistic. You can choose a lot of different things. You can notification center, plug in. Um, right here it is in notification center. I've got it set up to appear there. All right. Pretty awesome tweak for a buck. Okay, guys. Let's keep moving. Um, let's see what I got on my phone here that I can show you. Uh, Octopus Keyboard, $4.99. And if you don't know what it is, what it does is it lets you type much faster. It, it tries to, as you type, it learns your words. All right, and you can see as I'm typing here, let me start typing hello. Okay, you see it already. I can't hardly see from here. It learns your words. The more you use it, the more, the more it was will, will try to guess your words. All right, it's four ninety nine. Pretty awesome tweak. Guys, I think that's pretty much about it for the paid tweaks. And believe it or not, I looks like I've kept it under 10 minutes. So check out the next one's going to be on the free one. So stay tuned for that.